Good morning dear students. So in the previous classes we have learnt about the two forms of tense that is present tense and past tense and the subclassification of both present and past tense that is present tense has four subclassifications simple present, present continuous, present perfect, present perfect continuous tense and the same way Past tense has four subclassifications that is simple past, past continuous, past perfect and past perfect continuous tense. The third category of tense or the verb which speaks about the action that is expected to take place in the future time is what is called as future tense. So, tense athwa kala gadu hirtivi adara nithakantaha murade classification andre murade ritiya sub classification murade ritiya tense ya utu ondu present tense adre second is past tense and third is future tense present tense speaks to us about the action that takes place right now nadithiruva ghatane na present tense yagidre nade hogiruva ghatane bage past tense mahi ಮುಂದೆ ನಡೆಯಬಹುದಾಗಿರುವ ಅಥವಾ ಮುಂದೆ ನಡೆಯುವಂತಹ ಘಟನೆ ಇದೆ ಅದನ್ನು ನಮಗೆ ಇಂಡಿಕೇಟ್ ಮಾಡತಕ್ಕಂತಹ ವರ್ಗವನ್ನು ನಾವು ಫ್ಯೂಚರ್ ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ತೀವಿ ವರ್ಕ್ ಫ್ಯೂಚರ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇದ್ದಾಗ ನಾವು ಆ ಸೆಂಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನು ಫ್ಯೂಚರ್ ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಇರುವಂತಹ ಸೆಂಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಅಂತ ಕನ್ಸಿಡರ್ ಮಾಡಿ ಸೊ ದ ಡೆಫಿನೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಫ್ಯೂಚರ್ ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಡೆಫಿನೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಫ್ಯೂಚರ್ ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಇಸ್ a verb that refers to future time is said to be in future tense so which is which verb is said to be in future tense a verb which refers to future time so a verb which refers to future time is said to be in future tense what do you mean by this and then the verb which denotes the action that is expected to take place at some point of time in the future said to be in future tense so a verb which denotes an action a verb which denotes the action denotes the action which is expected to take place in the future ಬಟ್ 
is still expected to take place at some point of time in future. And in the same way, future continuous tense. Future continuous. Continuous and then continuity and it takes And then action in progress. So action in progress, yava. Egala, egale ago videya. But action will be in progress at some point of time in the future. And then munde aga bahuda giruvantaha action. आ action continuity ले तक करना दो अंतह और बरना ना वो future continuous tense तो है ना भी हाँ का दे future continuous tense ना 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 वो को पढ़ सकते हैं future continuous tense is used to represent the action that will be in progress that is planned at some point of time in the past and will be in progress ये गाने दो प्रारंभ आगे दो अंदर फ्यूचर का दिया दो नान मारे तो आधो कंटिन्यूटी अलग तक करना एक्शन में दे आधा ना ना वो फ्यूचर कंटिन्यूअस चल संदेह आधे रीडी फ्यूचर पर परफेक्ट फ्यूचर परफेक्ट टेंस है नहीं दे ये तो ये कल भी ये परफेक्ट टेंस बोथ इन प्रेजेंट एंड पास में बातें तक करना दे नो मुकुट हो गयी which will be completed by a specific time. Nirdishta samaya nekide, a samaya dhalage, a one the plan maadhi ruwa action, complete agitta kantha dhanna, suchu sikke, future perfect tense anna, use maadhi vi. Future perfect continuous tense anna na avu yava ga use maadhi vi. Future perfect continuous tense anna na avu, future anni, andre the action which will be taking place at some point of time in the future and which will end at some point of time. And then, Iga Munde plan Maditu Agatade Nadiyutta Yutta De Hagu one particular point of time and the complete Agate Anodana Suchus Nikanao Future Perfect Continuous Tense and I use Future Perfect Continuous Tense actually indicates an action that is represented as being in progress and at one particular point of time or period of time when the nirdishta vandhani adu end aagatte anodana suchisthikkenamge now future perfect continuous tense na use maadthivi yava rithi nimige simple simple present matthu simple past ige form ibaritto adhe rithi simple future gukurannu adharadhe agitta kantha form ibaritte and simple past matthu simple present yavde rithi yavde hechina details anna kodade it spoke about the action that take place or that took place so adhe rithi the action that will or shall take place that is expected to take place at some point of time in the past adhanna namige vekta padisthikke nao balusta kantha hattens ennide adhu simple future tense So, simple future tense are now we have a use of activity. It's used to denote an action which is expected to happen or which is expected to take place at some point of time. The first, and then I used to think it, we need to be college, but TV, what TV, TV, class, get by TV, you go to new, and then I did it, and I am a good idea, you are going to be in the country, and then I am going to be in the country. Simple future tense नले नाम है कम्स ठीक so first of classification is simple future tense so simple future tense simple future tense is used to denote an action which will take place at some point of time in the past. Simple future tense represents an action that is expected to take place at some point of time in the so at some point of time in the future. It is used to represent sorry, again future hello general past tense. I'm sorry for that. It is used to represent. that is expected 
expected to take place at some point of time in the future. I 
will come tomorrow or I shall come tomorrow nanu ini gabbidavantaha vidha prashnadana matra ide chinche maadi bandirtakkantadu i am giving you examples both you see will and shall hagagi so i is the subject here i is the subject will or shall adaradrodage yavudadadru maribodu ante helidri adaradage bartakkantha will or shall form so will or shall then comes come happens to be main verb in its present form in its present form followed by ought okay in the same way we we will complete the work tomorrow by next week tomorrow ne aage konte ni so you can use any time reference that's after the present form hagagi we plural form of first person we subject we will start the project next year we will start the project next year in the same way this is example for using of writing sentence using will hagagi will we get will subject ide will or shall ali bartakkantaha will ana bartidevi start is main verb in its present form the project next year is the object the project is the object next year time reference so in the same way shall ana balaskon bariyodadre we shall meet tomorrow we shall meet tomorrow athwa inni kuda ga bare yakant helide iga morning time anna helide heluvaga neevu inni kanna bartu kuda no the next evening athwa today evening even that is something which speaks to you about future we shall meet next week means subject shall that's we got shall and we got that part shall meet is the main verb in its present form next week time reference next is you second person singular and plural you second person singular and plural are you 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 will win the match you will win the match you subject win without shall and even the kanta will when main verb in its present form the match object then you shall you shall play in the match you shall play in the match so shall means you may or you may not so subject you then will or shall followed by main verb in its present form in the match object next is third person singular he he will he will play the game 
verb. He will. You can use any other verb. He will. Stand there. He will stand there. Subject. Devotion. Minimum. There. But idu matadu vaga spoken format no dekhe. He will stand there, he will sing in the competition. Yes, uh, let's change the verb for your better understanding. confusion He will sing in the competition. He shall. He shall He shall dance to the tune but he shall take part he shall dance in the competition Helping verb, helping verb, and then main verb. 
work is let continuous form followed by change. Okay? ING form continuous agarode in the ING and the present participle and the use mark in the Future continuous tense is also called as future progressive tense, which means it speaks to us about the action that is in that will be in progress. Munde Nadi Tiruvanta Hagatane. Okay. Ilina helping Babanta Batu. And he helping Babani in a take. Will of Shadirate, Matu Will of Shadna Jate or again, be for Mina, be he be in a take. Hagadi, Nadidana.
B, that's the key verb. Complete, main verb, that you are ready for. Notes, object. She will be watering the garden. She will be watering the garden. Watering and filling it, and you have to come to the So, subject, the love shell, helping work, watering, that's my work, and it's an Subject, they, so it, it will be the gate. Perfect and future perfect continuous steps. Thank you, Dexter.